All right, welcome back to Bianca's Tarot. Um, sorry, I'm just getting my cards together. Today, well, I'm going through, I've been going through like my requests and like what's highly requested. Listen, I don't know, my Selena Gomez videos go like, I don't, I'm not gonna say viral, it's not, it doesn't go viral, but they, they're the, like my top most viewed videos. And it seems like her fan base is pretty, they, they go strong for her. They go, they go really strong for her. And I respect it. I respect it. Um, Selena Gomez, she seems like a... She actually seems like she's been through a lot. I even just read something where, like... Um, I wasn't digging for it. It just came up on my, my feed and Twitter that she um, ha was diagnosed with bipolar or whatever. So it seems like she's had some rough... Um, some... You know, she had the lupus thing. And, like, it seems like she's one of the celebrities that does have to go through some unfortunate battles i mean everybody has things but she's had some health problems as well which you know hopefully she's okay but um sorry i'm just getting my ish together yeah so let's guys i'm a mess today let's get into the reading um yeah, so I think this is one of the first celebrities I'm doing twice, if I'm not mistaken. Because usually I just do it and then, like, I'm on the list. So it's been a couple months since I've read for Selena. Um, so let's see what, what comes through in the reading. It's been a... Yeah, it's been a couple of months, so I'll be interested. And that's how I like to do my readings. Sometimes it's good to let readings um, set, you know? All right, so what's the overall energy like for Selena Gomez right now? How is she doing? Two of Pentacles, Four of Swords. Um, you know, she's okay. I just think that, um, now I gotta clarify. All right, I think right now she's trying to juggle a lot of things in her life. Like, um, could be really busy or whatever, but she's trying to juggle a lot of things out. I think she's generally feeling really tired. I think she likes to rest more now these days. She's not really out like that. I actually see her being kind of like an introvert. Um, that's what I'm feeling. It seems like she's getting to a lot of arguments with people that um, she feels like, are not being honest with her or that's why this is coming up that it feels like there's just like a lot of um back and forth and you know it feels like somebody could have she could be feeling betrayed or just kind of like it's not fair and like kind of fighting for something that's just unfair or she feels wronged by someone or there could just be tension inside of her it's about somebody she feels um treat like she wasn't treated well um, it, I don't know who this is revolving around, but it feels like it could be multiple people. She feels like on um, things are unfair with her with some connect some ish, with people. Oh my god, I'm like stuttering. I'm sorry. Um, that happens when I channel sometimes because like the information, like it's like downloading. So it's like I can feel everything that she's feeling, but like to relate it is like to say it is weird. Um, she feels like it's like I feel like um. I'm not connecting well with people like that's how she feels like she feels like she's feels wrong she doesn't feel like things are being treated fairly and it's going against her morals like with the hero font that's like especially with seven of swords that's like it's it's morally wrong you know it's not fair I'm just hearing it's not fair it's not fair so she feels like things are a little bit unfair um well yeah so let's see what's going on with her love life i'm so happy um since i did my selena gomez video that was a while ago so i've gotten to more in the flow of how i do these readings i break it down now with like love career friendships family um which i think is good because it gives a general thing i don't have like specific questions i think that's the best way to go so what's going on with her love life King of Swords. There's a guy here. There's definitely a guy here. Nine of Pentacles. Page of Pentacles. 
there could be a guy that's showing a lot of interest in her at the moment. He's really emotionally available for her. He really likes her. Like, really, when I get the Page of Cups, that, that, I've been noticing it's like a really strong crush. Like, the guy is crushing hard. I don't know if it's going to lead anywhere, though, but I, I do feel like there's a guy, he feels new. He, he doesn't feel like same old. It feels like a new person. They could be young. Younger than her. Nine of Pentacles, the Chariot, Page of Pentacles. She could be dating. It doesn't feel too serious to me, though. It feels like it's beginning. So it feels like she's been dating. But Nine of Pentacles is also, like, kind of a single card sometimes. It's like she's more focused on her career and stuff than, like, a relationship. I do think she wants that. I got the Four of Wands. This could, this guy she's dating, could it could lead to a relationship. Um, but she's also kind of hurt a little bit but by some things in the past, so... It's weird. It's like kind of like it depends. It could go either way. This could form into a relationship or it could not, but um it could go either way. That's what I'm feeling. Oh, I forgot to do the oracle for her energy. Shit. All right, I'm going to do the oracle later, but um damn it. I I knew I was forgetting something. I was going so fast, but All right. I'll do the oracle next. What's going on in her love life? Free yourself. It's time to take back control of your life. She could be out there dating. That's really possible. Pay attention to the red flags. I don't know if she um, completely trusts this person yet. There could be red flags that she's looking out for. Or that have already showed up. Um, very soon. I don't know. I got two page cards here. I think there's could be a, no, a new relationship coming from for her. She's gonna be with someone, like committed. I see it being public too. Um, or you know, she's gonna have to decide if she, there's a guy that she's dating if she wants this. Um, I see a connection coming in that's gonna be more genuine though. I don't know when, but it feels like it'll be coming in soon for her. Um, but I feel like she's not really focused on love right now. She, the, her energy doesn't feel like somebody that's, like, planning a wedding, you know? Doesn't feel like... I'd be really surprised. I'd be really would. She doesn't feel like she's in that mood. I don't... I'm not getting lovey-dovey, uh, things from her. She feels more single and, like, still, like, exploring. She doesn't feel s completely focused in on one person, like yeah like this is my soulmate like i think she's being cautious um even if she's dating i mean i would too if i was in her if i was that famous could be somebody in the industry as well i'm not sure air sign water sign um uh i forgot to do the oracle for her energy so let's just ask again real quick how she is with the oracle cards solar plexus chakra that chakra could be really important for her right now um i got three twice so three could be important rejoice and celebration there's something to celebrate there's something to celebrate for sure but then i got the balance card i feel like she's just trying to i, I keep getting i i said that again she's balancing out a lot of things in her life all right um there's more things to celebrate Ooh. I just knocked over my camera. Wait, hold on. Let me check. I'm gonna have to edit this. Maybe not, whatever. I think there's more things to celebrate than to be like sad about. It feels like it's positive. Three, I, I really like that number. That's like a lucky, it's one of my favorite numbers, so. Gosh, it's so hot here. All right, let's move on to career. All right, so All right, how's her career? How does she feel about her career? 
I got the Nine of Pentacles again. She's really focused. She's doing a lot of great things. Page of Swords. She could be working with a young person. Um, this. She's also learning a lot about herself and what she, new things she wants to do. Um, there will be something successful, really successful, really public. Um, I wouldn't be surprised if she went on tour soon or this this thing that she's working on this project goes I see a lot of success for her like I see a lot of success coming like with her music it could she could be working on a project with a male um she's learning a lot she's learning about her dislikes her likes it's a great time for her career I actually think she's at the base I got the emperor she's really inspired like if anything um and she's learning about her dislikes and her likes but I see major successes, like number ones as well too. Like I'm seeing that in my head. It's like popping in my head for her. So that's great for her. Um, all right, let's do, let's do friendships. How is she feeling towards her friends? How is she feeling towards her friends? The hangman, king of swords. I got the king card again. This guy that likes, that I was bringing up early, he could be a friend as well. Um, I got the Emperor. Feels like there's more male friends and, or, or her friends are more ma masculine, if anything. I got all these guys here. I actually think they like her down low, so I wouldn't, um... She has more male friends or friends that are, have masculine energy than anything. Feels like there's a guy in her life um it could even be family that's more that's just giving her that great support that great support i'm not seeing so many female friends if, and at the base i got knight of cups it feels like there's it could be through association with music or i don't know i see her father is here as well i think she's really really close to her father or a male in her family and it's like they're more of her friend than her family like it feels like um there's a guy here that's like her best friend or something yeah it seems like there's more males of, of friends in her life than anything and it's also great they're really supportive i think they help keep her head on straight all right so let's do it's funny because i do feel like it's family members though i'm about to ask about family but it feels like it's more i feel like i kind of answered it but how is she feeling towards her family the son somebody could be having a baby in her family or is it just like a lot of happiness there's a new member coming in the family i see a little boy or girl here maybe boy i think there's some stagnancy though i feel like um Maybe she may not, might not be able to be around them as much, which kind of causes like her not like she goes through periods of time where she has, literally has no idea what's going on with them, but then they come back around and it's fine. So I just feel like the two of swords is representing like a lot of mental conflict, um, a lot of like maybe not really going to them for some decisions. Maybe she could go to them more for like help for like if she can't make a decision. I think she's leaving them in the dark about some things. But for the most part, it's okay. And I, I see a new member. I don't see it's her. I don't think it's her having a baby. It seems like there's a new, uh, a little boy or girl coming in the, well, of course, boy or girl, but like, it, it seems like there's a baby coming in. She could become an aunt or, I don't know. There's, a, there's an additional member coming in for sure. Very, very soon. Or it's already happened. All right. So let's do her future. What's coming up in the future for Selena? I keep getting four swords. I do see her resting. I see her taking a lot of time to herself and just not really, I don't really see much going on really. Like I see actually she might take a couple weeks off or something and just like rest. Um, there's a guy coming forward. I think there's gonna be a guy she actually begins to like he's really romantic he's gonna be really patient with her it seems like she might there's a guy that might become of importance in her in her life a couple soon i don't know 
I got the high priestess. I see her kind of being really to herself. Like, I don't see her really doing much interviews. I don't see her doing... Like, I feel like she's going to be really to herself. And there's this guy coming along. There could be two guys. She might have to choose. But nonetheless, there's a guy that's going to be really important. I honestly just see her being more to herself. And maybe doing less, like interviews or whatever i don't even feel like she's going to be in the mood to do that and there's something with her father or like a male in her life that's like really of importance as well but that's what i'm seeing i'll, I'll do the oracle cards within the next few months compromise wait I just see her waiting, but it's not for anything she wants. It's just like it's for the right time, like when she's more in the mood or something. Because I feel like she's just going to want to rest and like kind of take a... I don't really think she likes the fame. Like, she feels a lot like me. And she's a cancer, right? Like, I got a moon in Scorpio. I don't really think she's like into that anymore. At least not anymore. I feel like she's getting tired of that lifestyle. Like, I think she just wants to really kick back and like quarantine or whatever um she's not really gonna be in the mood to like be going out and doing premieres or like I, I, it feels like somebody that wants to like draw back like draw inwards you know all right so that's my reading thank you so much for over 700 subscribers for the selena gomez stands this here you go um hope you like the reading and um if you would like to book a personal reading with me you're more than welcome to um, but that's my reading for her, okay? Thank you for watching, and have a good day. Bye.